So to collapse it down, you simply lift this up to unlock it, swing it inward. Now there's gonna be two snaps, one here and one at the end. And then to lower it down, you lift up and it just slides on down. This whole system can be taken off to obviously load your toys and whatnot. And to do that is you pull a pen on each corner. There's gonna be one here, there, and then the same on the other side. And the whole screen porch area will simply come right on out. And then to get your ladder off, you just... This is on the ground. Get the stabilizer foot. This also comes off. You, sit, you lift up, it's locked in. You unlock it, you lift up, and it folds in on. The way that this goes up and down as well is you got the two carabiners. You simply lift up. Like I said earlier, all you do is just pull these four pins on each corner and the screens will come out and you'll be able to go inside. You have an outside uh, TV port. It does cable, satellite, antenna. You just simply hook a coax into it, into your TV. Plug your TV in here and you can either set it on a table or get a wall mount, whatever you prefer. We have a spare tire here, which has a crank handle. You simply stick it in there, it'll crank up and down. I guess we should probably finish it outside. Oh, yeah. Outside, you also have a spray port here. This is strictly just cold water. You hook a hose into it. It's a quick disconnect hose like we did on the shower on the other side. And that way you can clean off your awnings or your porch area, the camper, you know, whatever you prefer. The steps simply fold in by folding in on themselves. Just like so. This handle to open and close, you simply lift up and swing it one way or the other. You have two outside speakers, one on either side of the steps. And then your low point drains here are located behind this door, which are just two little T-valves. And that will drain about 90% of the water out of the water lines. If you lift those up to open them and open up all your faucets, it will drain 90% of the water throughout the whole system just down on the ground. You have an outside vacuum area here to operate it. You just simply turn it on or turn it off. You have a light on both sides. Here's the crank handle here for your spare tire. This right here is your winterizing hose. And then we provide you two adapters, one to plug into 50 to 30. That way, if you go to a campsite that does not have 50 amp, you can simply still go camping, just probably won't be able to run all the ACs at once. And then we have a 30 to a 15, so you can plug that in, so you can plug it into your normal house outlet to get your battery start to charge up, you know, get the refrigerator going, things like that. This jug of water here is strictly ran to the refrigerator and the water spigot next to the kitchen sink for drinkable, nice, clean water. Here is the other propane tank. And to get them out, you simply just turn this, push, and it opens right up. These are 30-gallon propane tanks, and they are full, ready to rock and roll.